Hello students, welcome back up to the online class again. Now in the previous classes, we have completed our chapter number 1, 2 and 3. Now, let's continue with our chapter number 4. Right, this is the first visualization class of chapter number 4. That is, inserting objects in MS Word 2010. How can we insert objects in MS Word 2010? This we are going to see in this chapter number 4. Chapter number 4, inserting objects in MS Word 2010. Now let's see here. Chapter number 4, inserting objects in MS Word 2010. Now, what are the topics we are going to learn? We are going to study in this chapter. You will see here. Now, you will be learning about creating and editing word art. How we can create and how we can edit word art. These we are going to learn and changing the appearance of drawing objects. How we can change the appearance of the drawing objects. These also we are going to see here. And inserting clip art and pictures. How we can insert clip arts and what are clip arts and how we can insert pictures. As you know, pictures, how we can insert pictures and clip arts. These also we are going to study, we are going to learn in this chapter number four that is inserting objects in MS Word 2010. Now let's start our chapter. You can change the appearance of your text using word art. Or even inserting objects such as pictures and clip arts. Uh, even we can insert pictures, objects such as pictures and clip arts, and we can change the appearance of the text by using what art. Okay, well, by using this what art, we can change the appearance of the text, or even insert objects such as pictures and clip arts. Clip arts, clip arts, and pictures are. are all as objects of inserting insert objects such as pictures and clip arts. Now let us explore the special features of MS Word 2010 one by one. Okay, special features in there, MS Word 2010. Do you have special features in there? What are the special features? Now let's see in this. Now what art? The what what art is a text styling feature of MS Word. The what art gallery includes different style of writing which can be applied to the text. Now we can apply different styles of writing in this word art by taking this word art. So what is word art? Word art is a text styling features of MS Word. You can underline the first line here in word art, see word art, see first line see. You can underline this. What is word art? Okay, a question may be, a question may arise like this. What is a, what is a word art or what is word art? So the answer in one line should be what art is a text styling feature of MS Word. MS Word key text style tonga ba feature amane what art se. Okay, in any different styles, ma'am, the what art key. The what art gallery include different styles of writing which can be applied to the text. It will text with the apply to very different styles. Now, inserting a what art. How we can insert a what art? What are the steps to insert a what art object? You know, what are object steps in okay no let's see here to insert a what art object in a document in a ms word document if you want to insert a what art object now you have to follow the steps given below now let's say the first step you should do is to place the cursor where you want to insert the what art you know what art humming you have to place the cursor Okay, because you know when what you see on the what document a blinking line blink toggle line the malay that blinking line is known as the cursor. Do you know cursor high a And a pointer will be there wherever you whenever wherever you move the mouse, that pointer will also move. Now suppose I'm moving the mouse here. Okay, whenever I move the mouse the pointer will also move if i move to the pointer to the left the, if i move the mouse to the left the pointer will come to the left if i move the mouse to the right the pointer will come to the right if i move the point mouse to the up the pointer will go up when and i bring it down the pointer will bring it the pointer will come down 
Okay, this is the pointer, mouse pointer. Kau isi na, adu ga, kau ina MS Word itu dokumen da blink to another line am lagi do, adu guna kau ina cursor hai ke tengen. So that cursor you should place where you want to insert the what are. Tangan what are hamning ima pada ja cursor do klik to tapi ni. Okay, I'll explain it theoretically first. I have a theory when I'll when I'm explain to you again. Then after that, I'll explain it practically also. Have a theory, have a way to explain to you. I'm going to go on a practical to you. I'm going to go. Okay, to make you more understand. Have hand and hand. We're going to go. Theory is have a way to explain to you. So we're going to go. It practically, I'm going to practical to you. I'm going to go. We're going to go. Okay. So listen carefully. Now, after placing the cursor where you want to insert the what are, the next step, that is the second step you should do, is to click on the insert tape. There are many tabs there, home tape, insert tape, paste layout tape, view tape. There are many tabs there on MS Word 2010. So, what you have to do, you have to click on the second tape, that is the insert tape. Home tape key head, right side the insert tape, like Nikon. So, click on the insert tape on the ribbon. Insert tape, you have to insert tape, you have to insert tape, that area is known as the ribbon cover. A drop down menu appears. When you click on the insert tape, a drop down menu appears. Now, next step is to in the text group. Insert tape, click on the drop down menu. I am going to insert the ribbon. Then, many groups will be given there, like illustration groups. They give you head, header, and footer, text group. Mayam matola ni ko group. Mayam mat you can see many groups there. So in the text group, you have to choose the. You have to go to the text group. So in the text group here, what art will be there? Okay, click on what art. You have to click on the what art. What art that click to view? What art that click to view? Then after that see. Many groups will be given there like tables, illustrations. Okay, many such groups like header and footer, links, text. So you should click on the text. It's a pity. You should go to the text groups. It's a pity. Then you actually have to click on the word art. And after that, next step is the shape and formatting characteristics of word art object are called word art style. These are the word art style. These will appear. Click on any word art style from the box that appears on in figure number 1B, the word art style. See, ma'am, you have to choose which word art style you want. You can choose any of these. Okay, the different styles are given here. The word art will create a text box. Okay, the default text will be your text here. For entering text in the chosen style. Now, choose the word style with the mat computer number sum, mat tomta, hana. Your text here and how can you that is known as the default text. Computer number one, the general text. You open the default text. Go we now you can change this text where whatever text you want to enter, you can enter here or you can type here and type to below. Because you your text here is a delete or gone. And any text you want, you can type. Okay, after choosing your styles here from the what are styles, then type the desired text. As I told you, type the desired text. Apart from text, you either need then. Click OK when done. When you are done, you have to click OK. The text that appears in the document now is called what art object. And OK whenever when you click. As soon as you click on the OK button, the text that appears, the text that appears in the document now is called what art object. अगर थोड़ा ही बात टेक्स्ट में कोई ना करें हैं कोई ना वन आर ऑब्जेक्ट में बात वन डॉक्यूमेंट थोड़ा ही बात टेक्स्ट में कोई ना वन आर ऑब्जेक्ट नाउ यू कैन अप्लाई वन आर टू ऑलरेडी टाइप टेक्स्ट आल्सो दिस इज डन बाय सेलेक्टिंग द टेक्स्ट एंड देन फॉलोइंग द सेम स्टेप्स एस गिवन अबाउट ओके यू कैन Apply what art to already type text also. If you want to change the text, suppose if you want to, you have already created a what art object. Then after that, you realize you want to change. Now you want to change the text. Okay, that also can be done. You have to follow the same process. This is this is done by selecting the. You have to first select the text, then following the same steps as given above. You can follow the same steps. What we have. Then above the five steps here. Okay, 
this is what we can do if you already apply a what are also you can change the text now you know how to insert a what are object so you can try this at home practice time if you have computer you can try this home you can try this at home in computer later but you can try to work as you have try to work as you have okay now after blowing the shapes which i explained just now now type the following text in ms word using word art now save water check all tapes and files for leakage install water savings shower heads and ultra low flush toilets take water showers never use toilet as an ashtray or waste basket turn off turn off the water while brushing your teeth now these are some takes given here okay now you can try these takes by using the word art by taking the word art object or instead of big takes also you can try any other takes you can write your name you can write your uh, uh, address yum gi address hapaga or yum gi ming iraga what are the hapa i think same as way cd just take up iraga cd takes a one up key matin in a season or have any you can try it with your own name in the ming season iraga what are season number to or gm okay the thing is you need to use the what art which whichever text you take you need to use the what art and you see how to take you you have to see how to you have to practice how to insert what art on a word document what art kamaina what document happy have doc that is the important thing not the text it takes and similar way the you need to you can put any text and it coming to take you up a case of idea to the book and what art kamaina insert the we ms what the have doc that is more important Okay, the thing is, you have to know the steps to insert a what are in a what document. What document number the what are kamanya? Insert to we have the a do never more ways. I do not see the text. Any text you can put your name, your address, whatever. Any text you can put. Now after knowing how to insert a what are object, now let's see here formatting what are. What is formatting? Formatting means what? Formatting means to make it more beautiful, to make it more interesting. Hena fazan ba hena un look na wagi da magta fazan na wagi da magta to betha bokto that is known as formatting. So how we can format a word? A word ase kamay na fazan ge dagi. I will say now let's see here. Now when you insert what are in a word do in a document, the format tab appears on the ribbon. On the ribbon above. Remember that only format tab set hold on it. When you click on the word art, only when you click on the word art, this format tab will appear. Okay, as I told you, I'll explain it practically also afterwards. Practically, kona hake. Now just listen carefully. The technical part here. Only when you click on the word art, this format tab will appear. If you don't don't click, if you click anywhere else, this format tab will not appear on the ribbon. See format tab say, and now what are the click to bring it to the way, what are the click to the kind of thing to format tab say, appears on the ribbon. Got it. Now, click on it and to get, to get the tools for formatting and editing insert, editing the inserted what are object, what, whichever what are you have inserted on, on the document, if you want to edit, if you want to format, if you want to make it more beautiful, more interesting, this if you have to click on the what are then this format tab will appear then on that format tab there are various ways in which what are object can be formatted there are various ways let us learn about each of them one by one okay let us learn each of them one by one there are various formatting techniques or various ways in which what are can be formatted now changing the text field Text the half the bar color to change the way have to do when you're changing the text field. I see this is one of the ways. Maggi the people formatted key for the no people you formatted key. But color money is okay. The text field consists of colors and gradients used to fill the text of the word art object. The steps to do so are as follows. Step number one click on the word art object. You have to just click on the word object, then this 
format tab will appear the format tab will appear under the drawing tool okay under the drawing tool this format tab will appear then after that in the what style what art style group click on the text fill option you have to click on the text fill option shown in figure number 2a just it, it is shown here the text fill option in what art when you click on the text fill option different colors different color themes will be will appear here okay you can choose any of these colors now let's see here now you can choose from the variety of options that appear choose the desired color from theme colors or standard colors so on in figure number 2a just shown on to figure number 2a the pdb color map though theme color or the standard color though you can choose any color if whichever you want from the palm look and or if you do not wish to add any color you can choose the no fill option if you don't want to fill any color you can choose the no fill option no fill means no color will be filled okay then after that or if the desired color is not available in the theme color on the standard colors given here now let's see here now given here are some colors if your desired color is not given here is not present here stated an apama color you can either you can choose the no fill color half the bama or if you want different color that is not on the theme color or the standard color you can color you can click on more fill colors more fill colors option the click to wear it then you can choose the color you want from the standard tape or make your own color from the custom tape so in figure number 2b and 2c now the standard color of tape option is given here and the custom color or tape is option given here now there are many colors here you can choose any color whichever color you want you can choose it from here or you can see the custom color tape here from here also you can choose your color then after that another option available is to change the is to change the fill gradient now if you don't want to put these colors you can fill it with gradient click on the gradient and click on the gradient variation you want in what are shown in figure number 2 the gradient different gradient styles will be given here okay this gradient is already given hana gradient sing the hana lo mang yao leng ani yao ri ba gradient sing do the gi nang na apam ba gradient do khan bi ro adu ga tek chu da fill do ba now this is how we can fill the text <coughs> now after filling the text the text is the color happiness in next is the changing the text outline when you take to the color happy or gradient happy and try to get the same to have to see it so that you know fill change okay that when you see now takes the color option money then next is not changing the text outline this is the next topic is that changing the text outline did it takes to the happy but color don't have takes to be outline had the border the color happening changing the text outline outline had the takes again see suppose this uh theme I see teams in the black color shangi na say that okay she's a doggy black color happy say she's never seen a standard color when a team color not a no fill not a gonna when a city a more fill the channel happy or gradient how to do it see man using the colors new as you can changing that text outline means only not the color inside the outline that is the border of the text in for takes again border the outline happens and that is not just changing the text outline now let's see here what are the steps here given here now to change the outline of a what art object the steps are as follows now select the what art as before now the format tab will appear as i told you in the uh, previous topic also in the what art style group click on the text outline near now here will not click on that text field hanadi will click on the text field but here we'll click on the text outline hanadi konya text field the click to it na sena text outline to ina click to run ever and you can choose a text outline color from that theme color option it is given hojiki hajj but just i have told you just now like it minor theme color not a standard color sangani as given in 3a that's the piece minor or color hamun the no outline and the outline the color amta haparoi or if you want to choose any 
colors, any different colors that is not given in the thin color or the standard color P jaggedy as among the just we have done in the previous topic among the fill color ki changi maina more color changani and was standard color na tagana custom tepe changaga kambinani this is all same here now the only difference is there is also an option of changing the thickness of the outline by pointing the weight option and then selecting a thickness that is given on figure number 3b now let's see on next page in the 3b you know weight has na kaino hai kanda ki outline the kaino borderline the half of the color je ke ham na 54 ji ke ham na 58 ji ke pi agadi yam tik na outline do suppose the red half agadi red na outline se pin na aduga weight se jipani yam halagadi outline se thick hoina ke tan thana la ke do outline se so now let's see here in the picture given here now see here line thin line thin line thin line some, some more thick line in the thick line from kaga sum sum chocolate in a thin thin line thin line in a thick line thick line the thana thongera the pana thongera now you can choose from the weight given here now in order to change the width and the appearance of the outline that is the line style line je koina dotted line thongera or uh, dash line thongera or only just as a simple line thongera you can choose from the line style point on the dashes option now you can point on the dashes option just below the text outline ji weight ji just below the weight okay there is a option called dashes option and then select the style you want shown in figure number 3c see dot 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 dash dot dash like this in many different styles many line different different line styles are given here you can choose whatever line style you want from here then click on more lines option to get more advanced options of line styles and thickness from the format text effects format text effects is another more lines colors we have the outline of the uh, the format text effects dialog box now the outline of the word art object will change depending upon the selection you have made now the outline of the word art and the select of the word to be outline do object will change depending upon the selection you have made if you have made the line shall as dotted it will come on the what are as dotted outline okay line outline color line outline if you choose dotted outline it will come as dotted outline now for today let's do it till here only now changing the text effects we'll see in the next video session class okay so then for today let's stop our class here we'll see the next topics that is changing the text effects and the drawing objects how to draw the triangle and the star rectangle circle let's see on the next video session class okay students so stay home stay safe and stay healthy